on. Yeah, jump yeah, on up. What up man? It's been a while. All right, we can we missed you. Episode. We missed you. Finally, yeah, we'll get some people who don't know no lunch. Here. You okay? Were you taking off your shirt? <laughs> well, I was buttoning it up. You know, got to be proper. Yeah, you know, yeah. Famous. Welcome to another episode of Nerd, Nerd Out. Out. I am Randy. This is Brian. And this is Ming. 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 Ming is here because uh, she wants to see the VF31 Siegfried. Is that how you pronounce Siegfried, it? I guess. Yeah. So, mm. so you just got this uh, from Ami Ami, which you were so proud of. You said that their yes. customer service was great. And Showed up Thursday night. We don't even... actually keep the stuff in stock. Yeah. You know, like when it comes out, which is beautiful. HLJ, shame on you. They should do the yeah, same. Yeah, we can't. HLJ is pretty good. Though, They're pretty but, good too. But we're not getting paid. But you, you're definitely giving thumbs up to the Ami Ami. And yes, uh, please deal with them. They rule. Yeah. So uh, you brought this over, and uh, I can't believe you did not bring up over the other one. I didn't. You know, I didn't feel like packing it up again, man. <laughs> I mean, the whole it thing is like to compare, that. and you're you're like defending it, like like like. I don't give it. <laughs> exactly. It's you don't give it. a shot. So so uh, you expect me to give a proper review. Uh, without seeing the other one side by side. Well, a review and a comparison are two different things. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Mm -hmm. Well, we don't really review. We just tell you what we think. And, it, and exactly. Then... You know what you'd think? And if, what, if it were here, you'd be like, wow, it yeah. looks like this, but in like foo-foo color. Right, with right. A, with a not as cool head. All right, so so we'll get right to it. Which one do you like better? This one. This one? Of course. What is it about this one that, that, that you prefer? Well, anything that's neat, anything that you like in blue, gray, and white, is mm. always going to be cooler in black. Great, great white. white. It's just it's meaner looking. That's... It. I think this looks more militaristic. Okay. It, it, it's more. It's a more believable military plane. It has a weird skull on it, and I like. I really prefer skulls on my Macross. Yeah, stuff. no skulls. So skulls are cool, and it's yep. beautifully painted. Yeah. Uh, you did make note that the skull is on a, a, a transformation um, joint. Yeah. And uh, we show that we have video. Yeah, there, right? yeah, yeah. The most stressful <laughs> part of this whole deal is look at this beautiful emblem right here. Watch. Oh, like you, Ooh. yeah, you see what I'm talking about? Yeah. That's a huge Ow. painted joint. And it's like, that's not going to last. That I don't not. care. Like, that's what, that's my issue with this is it doesn't matter how careful you are, how much you like read the directions, it's going to scratch and there's no way around it, you know? And it's sort of like, sucks. It, that, I don't know how long that's going to last. I got to be honest. I mean, unless you're into the realism of your Macross toys looking like, Weathered yeah, in battle, yeah. which I'm not. That could uh, end for up model being kits. a problem. Yeah, yeah that's, that's for model yeah, kits yeah. and stuff. It's scary. So, uh, all right, so I haven't watched a minute. No, I watched 12 minutes of like yeah. Macross Delta, and uh, I am totally open minded to new Macross designs. Mm -hmm. I'm cool with robots. Can, can I say I honestly haven't fallen in love with this design? That's okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, I would imagine a lot of people haven't. You know, right. it's a. Uh, it, it it doesn't have the identity mm -hmm. that that some of the other designs have had because I mean, like they're like it, like after the VF twenty five yeah they sort of I I don't get mad okay but they flow together I I, I think they're they're what, what do you mean like VF twenty five to VF Thirty one. Yeah, they're really like the designs are really close. I agree. I agree. And, and that's not a bad thing. No, it's but, not a bad right. thing. But I think there's only so many ways you can make. May, may, make a, a plane turn into yeah. a biped, mm -hmm. you know? And it's like, like the robot, you know, with the CG and all that, it's almost limited them yeah. now because they have to make it physically work in Do, the real world. Does this, like, transform exactly like, is it, like, close? Is it close? I think it's pretty close. Yeah. You know, but that's why I'm excited about the dragon. Yeah. I, is that something new? I'm like, nothing looks like No, that. nothing. I, I, I'm excited for the dragon, but I will say, based on pictures, I... Can, I have not fallen in love with that design. Like, I love the jet. Yep. The jet's awesome. But I'm really excited for you to get it because it does... It's sort of like the... Whether you like the the uh, the Macross um, Stealth. What series yeah. was that from? Oh, uh, the, the Macross, the Macross 7. Plus. Macross oh, 7. 7? Okay. Yeah. Whether you like that or not, and that can be debated, it is very different. Yep, that was and I did one. appreciate that. And I loved, I loved those... Um, those Bandai figures, they probably are dated now, but they were such oh, a... the Fire Valkyrie Yeah, all that? yeah. Those were great for they their were time. Great. I remember when those came out, I thought that was the coolest toy... Me too. ...ever. I'm like, wow. Wow. 
And it's like I, sometimes I almost wish I didn't see all the animation because yeah. the stuff I played in my head was way cooler yeah, yeah, than what yeah. I, I, I don't want to say that. But that was, show is rough. Sorry, sorry to. to I mean, I love that yeah. show. Yeah. I love it yeah. now, but I didn't like it. It yeah. grew on me. But it's like sometimes I wish we could see the further adventures of Hikaru. Yeah. And oh, and I wish it followed up on that storyline, and they they do sort of in the back door mm -hmm. kind of way, like like a genius. Man, a genus family yeah. member has been in every episode. But right, all right, I see what you're show saying. Show me Hikaru, man. Um, I don't know what happened. I'm with you. Like, I, I'm uh, generally with my fiction, I, I always would rather push forward than to yep. stay backward. Yep. Like, you know, Star Wars prequels, all that stuff, that's fine and stuff, but I want to go forward. I want to move forward. I want the future. But for some reason, with Macross, Robotech, however you want to call it, I am, I am, I much prefer, like, seeing what happened. Uh, to Rick Hunter, the characters we Hunter. love. Yeah. yeah, you know. I'm old school. I am totally old school. This is this is my Valkyrie. And you know what? The thing is, is I don't want them to go. I, I want them to like fill in that gap afterwards, because there is a big part mm -hmm. of Rick Hunter stories that could be told between uh, Robotech and say New Generation. Yep. And I'll skip Masters yep. because I mean it's fine, but that's like. And, and the problem is, I don't think it's ever gonna happen. No, I no. think it died with Carl Mason. Yeah, yeah. Harmony Gold. And Harmony Gold. Yeah, they just do not Fast manage games. that product. But this is Macross, and I know we're gonna get told it's a different thing. The jet of this thing is awesome. I dig it. I like the design. Um, it looks like a high a high quality piece. When I first picked it up, I, I was like, wow, uh, this is this is serious. Yeah. Um, it's cool, I didn't man. transformation transformate it. Uh, I didn't transform it, so you're gonna have to tell everyone about the transformate. I mean, the transformation is pretty straightforward. I mean, it's like legs fold back, arms fold back, wings fold down. But what's sweet is this is a first Valkyrie I know of that actually the arms transform and don't just tuck in, like like and they go inside the wing, which mm -hmm. is really neat. Usually the the arms go in between the legs. Yeah, yeah. You know, and these actually go up in the wing. So when you have it in jet mode, you have like, like there's nothing. Like there's yeah. there's no giveaways that it's a like a robot right, right. or a mech. You know, which I, don't know. I guess there really, I guess there really isn't on other mecha, but it really really flows together. Yeah. It really, uh, what do you call it? sleek? It, it's like you look at it like, wow, I can't believe that can actually do that. This is rough. Yeah, I gotta be honest, okay. that's rough. And and yeah, and this is that. from the Kibble Master. Like I'm on board with Kibble, but that's rough, man. Yeah. I just wish there was a way. But I mean, that's probably show accurate, right? It's show accurate. It's it a lot like like Muv Love, you know? Muv Love, Muv Love. Uh -uh. Never. I don't know the story of it, but uh, it's it's like robots that are made out of jet parts. And they don't transform. Right. Never heard of that. But literally. it's like, you could tell it's an right. F-16, but... Yeah, what, what is it? Is it a show, or is it I think it it's like... a game. Oh, okay. It's really wow. popular in Japan. Muvla. I mean, they have a bunch of toy... Like, I like saying it. Yeah, Muvla. There's a bunch of toys and a bunch of models, mm -hmm. and they all look so cool. And yeah, I saw them, like, what does this turn into? Like, nope. So they're not intended to transform? No, they don't transform. I'm, I'm curious. But, I'm going to go check that out. Yeah, they're, they're crazy. Oh. Um, yeah, I, you know what, uh, I haven't seen Delta, so I can't, uh, the head design, I do want to, I want to say, like, I actually think I like this one better than the other one. Okay. Um, it is very bug-like, but that transparent, like, eyes are awesome. Mm -hmm. How did they do it? Is there, is there in the back? Where's the, uh, where's the, oh, it's not even, like, oh. Yeah, I think it's just, wow. I mean, really nice. It's just really done. Mm. I mean, this is a high-quality thing, it's just that, like. I think that they're, I think, I think, I'm, I don't want to even say that I'm a macro, a ro, I'm going to say Robotech, because I'm much more Robotech than Macross. I, I don't want to say that I'm stuck in the past, but uh, I, I think the future isn't as bright as the past when it comes to, but I, I can't really say yeah, that. I mean, I, I want to see, it. I want to see if VF1, this scale bond I do. It. Mm. That's what I want. I, mean, I totally. I agree with you. I mean, Robotech is where it started yes. for me. Right. And the Macross, even, and then just if, my, fuck all that. Just Macross alone. Yeah. The first series is my favorite. Absolutely. The only thing, like, but I might like, no, I'm not going to say that. Yeah, the first yeah. one is my favorite for sure. This, my friends, this is a Valkyrie. Uh, yeah, you know? between that and New Generation, which would be most yep. Beata, but they're, they're almost like you could separate them almost completely mm -hmm. and enjoy them both. I love all the panel lining. You know what I do appreciate about these is th they don't look tuned up to me. Like, they don't look like they're like, oh, let's make soft. I mean, even though I guess the cartoons are probably pretty dynamic designs, but yeah, I, they're pretty I like sharp. panel lines. 
Um, it is a very, it is a very modern robot. Yeah. Um, and I like, I like stuff a little blockier. Um, so are you in it to win it then? I think so. Here's, here's where, here's where I'm going to draw the line. Okay. Where if Ami Ami continues to get this stuff at retail, I'll buy everything okay. I, at retail. Re, what's retail? To, from a store. Like, it's about 200 bucks. Okay. Somewhere in the $200 range. If I can get it without having to go through eBay, I'm in. Right. I'll buy whatever I can get. I gotcha. So, uh, I mean, 200, uh, 200 bucks is, a, is a lot of money. Like this definitely just by looking at it, it looks like $200 quality, but it's really hard to pull the trigger on a $200 toy, especially mm. because it doesn't look, it doesn't look like you can like get on the ground and play with it. Yeah. I know it, it, it does look very spindly yeah. and I hate this. It, like for something that takes a beating, mm -hmm. it, you want to just tear into, it's like, I don't know if that'll, this will survive that. And, and even if it will, the paint won't. Yeah. I mean, this thing is a chip magnet. It's, like, it's beautiful. Right, right. I mean, it's, 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 I, I, I wish totally, I didn't care. Yeah. I wish yeah. I didn't care and I could just look at it and play with it and not care, but it's like, you pull it out and it's like, man, I want it to be like this yeah. forever. And yeah. It sucks. The one thing I total give credit to, like, Takara's Masterpiece Transformer line, re like, regardless of aesthetic or whatever, they like, you could them. play with it. Yeah. Like, Inferno, yeah. like, Grapple, I could get down, and even though I didn't like looking at it, I could, I could beat the shit out of it. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh! Oh, yeah, very cool. Um, anything else? Yeah. You know, I, I could probably... Come yeah, on. yeah, yeah. Hey, uh, we we did that. Uh, we did that. Uh, nerd out at, at night. I, I had fun doing that. Yeah, I like think it? every. I loved it. I, it seems like everyone else did. Yeah, too. yeah. Except for kicking. like twelve people, but you know, no, is that's that what okay. we got? I think it is, but that's. But I still think they probably good. even liked it. Yeah. And they were just like. That was a lot of fun. We mm -hmm. we we hope we hope to continue doing that. I hope you guys liked it. Let us know what you think about that because uh, we had fun. Um, so I think it doesn't matter what you think. I think we're going to do it. Yeah, we're going to do it either yeah. way. You know, um, I'll, try, us. I'll try to find better angles than, uh, the camera up my nose. Mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, maybe I'll do a little bit of the toy back. Maybe just bring it down. Oh, bring it down. Bring yeah. it down. You gotta bring it I thought, down. I thought people might want. Well, bring to it up. In. No, you would bring it up. I'm sorry. Oh bring yeah, yeah. Up. My bad. Well, I'm using my wife's iPad, and huh? like it, it's on an angle, so it's like I just kind of put it on the table. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reconstruct my setup yeah. for for Thursday, so it'll be a little bit more flattering. I hope. Uh, you know, maybe put some more toys in the background. Maybe again, not have the camera up my nose. Uh, hopefully, I can get a fresh. Fresh fucking cut, man. I've been... Dude, yeah, I, I man. It, that's man. what people care about when they watch our show. Yeah, absolutely. Haircuts. Whether my hair's tight or not, dude. It's got to be it's tight. Important, it's important, man. It I, mean, I never trust a guy with, with bad hair. I know? I agree, man. you yeah. got to have some good hair, you know? Yeah. And My uh, hair is awesome, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like your I, I like your hair longer huge. better than uh, when you when you buzz it. I think reason. so, too. Yeah. My girlfriend's getting pissed. Really? She likes the buzz look? She likes the buzz and She just bought me the 262, so we got to see how that goes, man. Oh, wow. Yeah. What? What is it? Why does she prefer it? Is it just like what what she digs? Yeah, yeah I guess, I don't know. fair enough. I mean, she's the one that uh, that really matters about that, right? So, I mean, beside yourself. Like, yeah, I think like, so. You right. know, but like usually, I can't get it to long. I'll get it to almost long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Lose my shit. Right. Get annoyed, then yeah, yeah, one yeah. night and like get the best night's sleep I ever had. Right, right. Oh my god. Um, it is so much easier just to like buzz your head. Yeah, and it's summertime, like, dude, yeah. like, when you're mowing the lawn and you got like yeah. allergies, yeah. and you got allergens in your hair, yeah. and it's like, <laughs> shave it. When I start sneezing, I'm right. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm and you guys you. care about that. Absolutely, I know you this do. is important shit. Yeah. You yeah. know, I, I, uh, Anyways, uh, check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and uh, we're going to keep doing the Nerd Out at Night. Uh, that does sound like a Cinemax like, skin yeah, flick. Yeah, that's, 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 that's Maybe we got to come up with an intro where it's like, Welcome to Dude, Nerd Out at Night. Bow, bow, bow. Maybe we need more boobs, less sausage. Uh, I'm going to stop it. All right, this is cool. Uh, I guess if you're into it. Get it, guys. If you can find it, I highly recommend it. It's, a, it's like these toys are great. Man, yeah, I can't it. wait to see the Draken. And until next time, Nerd, nerd Out! out! You're gonna all miss this up the nose shot.